Yo, are you the type of person that you notice everything? And not on the level to where you're just assuming stuff, literally on the level of you almost can see stuff happening or you can understand why people do things. Or if somebody act a certain way towards you, you understand why and you can determine what's going to happen next. You can tell when somebody really don't like you, but they pretend to be so bubbly and happy and oh, you my guy, you my homie, you my bro. And not only do you know it on like a knowledge level, but you can almost feel it. You can feel that it's not authentic. You can feel that it's not real. Now, like I said, I used to try to get rid of this feeling because I'm like, oh my God, you know, it's gonna make me paranoid. You know, when I was younger, I'm like, nah, I'm tripping, I'm tripping. And, and most of the time where I would tell myself that I'm tripping or I was, it was the truth. So I would get in situations where I would be dealing with people or I'll be just dealing with specific situations for example, like I would know that a job was like ready to fire me, even if they like, yeah, I got you, Josh. Yeah, man, we're going to give you that raise on Tuesday or that friend you had was always showing you love, you know, giving you a little bro hug or or giving you excessive compliments and stuff like that. And yes, they do mask it correctly. I don't know if this has to do with being an empath, being a chosen one. But I don't want to put a label on it at this point, but I just think that certain individuals have that certain type of discernment and those who don't will make you seem like you're crazy or they or they try to gaslight you or think these. Oh, they'll say like you. Nah, it's not even that deep. Now, these people that are like going against what you say that they don't technically mean that they're toxic or whatever the case may be. Sometimes they really just think you are crazy. I think this video is more so for the individuals who who get it and who understand it. That's why. I kind of got to the point where I always speak my voice, you know what I'm saying? I always say what I got to say. I'm always, I've always been an outspoken person. I honestly can't hold stuff in for too long. But I kind of got to the point where in certain instances, depending on who I'm dealing with, I don't... It's not that I don't tell them everything, but it's like I play dumb because it's like no matter what I tell them at the end of the day, they're not going to really understand what I'm saying. And I can't me mentally beat myself up trying to... Oh, it's like talking to a narcissist or, you know, somebody who just like stuck in their ways. It's like, um, you like knocking on the door of their brain and they just don't understand what you're saying because some individuals, let's keep it a buck. Like they just don't know how to see other people's perspectives. I don't know why that is, but everybody different. The only advice I can give for individuals who operate like this, like to think like this is to slow down, get to know people slowly watch everything observe everything because if you don't you're gonna walk into something that you don't want to walk into and also you don't have to just jump out the window when you realize that something is going to go bad just slowly disconnect that's just my perspective what y'all think comment below